the landing nipple and lock mandrel. In my hand here, I'm holding a lock mandrel. If you look carefully, this is a tool with seals here at the bottom, and here you have some dogs, which are currently in their inside retracted position. As I lock the tool, you'll observe that those dogs are now locked out. Now let's see how we can install this into the landing nipple. Looking at the landing nipple here, this is a part of the completion tubing. This is installed when we install the completion. Let's look in at it inside. You'll see here that there's a specially machined profile. There's this sort of ring in the middle with an upper profile and a lower profile. You might recall that this matches the shape of the dogs I showed you on the lock. Let's look inside the tool at the bottom and below this cutout there's a shiny bore called a seal bore where the seals on the lock mandrel can locate. Now let's see how I can put the lock mandrel into the nipple. This will be lowered into the well on a wireline running string. So here it is, I'm lowering it inside the well. The seals will come into view first, the seals will go through the profile and into the seal bore beneath. The dogs are now coming into, sh into sight. I can go no further. I've hit what we call the no-go, which are, is a restriction in diameter. I now hammer down with my running string, watch the dogs, they are now locked in position. This tool is locked in the well. Okay, what is the purpose of this tool, you might ask? Well, this tool has very little purpose. If you look through it, you will see it is completely open through the centre. However, at the bottom here, there is a screw preparation, and on this I can install any number of tools that I decide. Typically, pressure gauges, a sampling tool, a subsurface safety valve, or, an example I have here, a plug. This is a very simple plug, it's just a solid piece of metal, no pressure equalisation. I screw this onto the bottom of my lock, Oops, a bit difficult, the thread's crossed. Oh my goodness, there it goes. And now I'm ready to run it into the well. In it comes. You'll see the solid metal coming in first. Here come the seals. Then the locks. And again, on depth, set the locks. And it is now locked in the well. It will not come in or out. Let's look down. It will now hold pressure from beneath, and it will also hold pressure from above. So my well is securely plugged. The lock mandrel and landing nipple.